Yo, bitch, I forgot like a sweepstake, and I eat her ass like a cheesecake. <laughs> Yo, he's thick! Yo, what's up, guys? Micro Psycho here. And today, or yesterday, we are back with the second story time video I have ever done on this channel. And today, we have a real doozy, a real whippersnapper doozy of a teacher that just, she just woke up on the wrong side of the bed. And then that's just she woke up on the wrong side of the bed, she rolled off the bed, and out her house, into traffic, and got hit by her car. She was just in a bad mood and ready to slap out some detention. But anyway, let's get right into the story. So this art starts off with a fourth grade micro, which was just before summer vacation started. But still, fourth grade micro. And I was just sitting there. Every, well, I wasn't sitting there. I was just at a recess, you know, playing basketball. Dunking on, I said ducking. Dunking on everyone like I'm Kobe, Michael, like I'm Kobe, George, Braun, Curry. Like, um... Joe, like, um, Joe, um, Joe, Joe, Cobra, Joe, bro, Co I, whatever, I, I was just playing basketball, and then, you know, just dunking on everyone, being the MLG quick scope 360 boss I am, you know, doing some 360s, you know, no scoping everyone, but, but that, besides that, let's get back to the story. So I was just sitting there, you know, playing some basketball, and then, t this day, like, it was like when, like, testing for ELGs and all that stupid stuff you no one needs in life, and it was, this was like when all that stuff was about to start, so me being, so the school being the school, they were like, hey, we can't have kids, like, run, going in and out the exit doors, where kids are going to be testing, so let's change the exit door. An entrance door. So, this is gonna be important later in the story. The exit entrance door is like you like you can't open it from the outside. Someone has to go on from the other side and open it. Like you can't open it from the outside. No one has unless you have the key, which only the principal has the key. It's like <laughs> I'm not gonna walk all over there just to open the door for you people. So she was like, <laughs> someone has to go open the door. I'm not doing it. So anyway, um, we were, uh, we were playing basketball, and like, the teachers being the bright, cookie color, genius, 10 out of 10 Nobel Prize scholars they are, they were like, hey, what if we go to the complete opposite spot where the basketball court is, and blow the whistle, because like, when the whistle blows, it's supposed to like, come to your teacher and be like, oh, <laughs> I was trying to make a joke, but I forgot what I was going to say, so, yeah. No joke! Anyway, so, you're supposed to go to your teachers, and they had that cookie other idea to go to the under, uh, to, uh, to the under, to the other end of the school, and be like, hey, you guys, over there, all the way at the basketball court, and, yeah, I want you guys to hear me, and bl uh, hear me blow the whistle, and come running. So, but I, I didn't hear them. And, um, the, 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 I have some friends that are going to be important in this story. We'll call one, the dude, we'll call him Brent, and the girl, Adri. So, I was like, hey, Brent, um, maybe, just maybe, our class left us. And, and like, we played, like, to, like, the last point wins, and we were just playing, and I was like, um, okay. And Brent was like, nope, nope, I'm not going. So I was like, um, Adri, um, I think, I think maybe, just maybe, our class left. And she's like, nope, nope, sorry, buddy, we're not leaving. Like, okay. So I bolted to the exit door, like you saying, bolt. Like, I swear, I never let, I never land. I never ran so fast in my life. Like, I was like, um, okay. I know our teacher said something about, you know, not being late. So I'm a just bolt anyway so the, i was running right and as soon as i stepped inside like the the teacher's pets were i mean the students were holding the door totally not teacher's pets what's a teacher's pet anyway i i can't, side note i really hate teacher's pets if you're a teacher's pet i do not like you and if you have a really good personality then we can be friends okay okay so yeah S side note from micro anyway so 
I, I, as soon as, like, so she ste- I stepped in, she was like, okay, everyone else after me gets detention. And I was like, ha ha, freeze all of you guys. And Br- Brent has gotten me in some trouble before, so I especially, so in my mind, I was like, freeze you, Brent, that is what you get, buddy. So, and then Brent, like the rest of them, they just kept playing basketball. And then Brent, being the half as smart person as me, he is, said, hey, I should probably go. And like, we were walking to the bathrooms because the teacher's like, nope, now you guys can go to the bathroom in class. What does this look like? Prison? No. Because like, prison, you can go. Yeah. Anyway, so, um, because like a prison, you can go to the bathroom whenever you want. So, like, I, I was like, hey, I mean, Brent was like, hey, what? I, I forgot where I was at. So, um, Brent, he came running, and he ran behind the teacher, and, like, he was trying to get in front of her, and the teacher stuck out her arm, and she's like, no, everyone behind me gets detention. I was like, and I looked at Brent, and I was like, you just should have followed me, buddy. You should have followed me. And he punched me in the arm. I probably deserved it. But he was a dick, so we're all good. I hope you enjoyed my story. If you didn't make sure, punch that like button in the face. Like I'm at the chicken boss. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.